All right, so we are here today yet again at the 2023 National Yo-Yo Contest. Can you introduce yourself for us? Hi, I'm John Wolf. I'm from Cole Center, Pennsylvania. I've been yo-yoing for about 16 years. Yeah, I don't think a lot of people don't know uh, John, right? So uh, 16 years is literally a lifetime, right? So what uh, what's kept you kind of in the yo-yo community for such a long time? Uh, I mean, since I was a kid, I, at one point I just had a real fascination with yo-yoing and, you know, I eventually found like the online community and that people are doing all these freestyles and like all the different tricks you can do. It was really exciting. So yeah, ever since I got my uh, first, I got Dark Magic, uh, Blue Dark Magic. The yo-yo -yo jam. Yo -yo. Yeah, it was over after that. <laughs> Yeah, Yo-Yo Jam was really cool because they, they were the first people to have like that the metal rims and yeah, they were the, really doing some cool the stuff. Cap designs and like the overall aesthetic and just like the old uh, JD and Andre videos. Oh like, man, really... Johnny was like, it was yeah. not, like it was nothing like it at the time when he dropped like the, the Hitman and like the, the ex-convict. Yeah, that PG-13 rating and you're just like, damn, this is nuts. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> it, my it voice is a little was. coarse because I was like screaming at a... Uh, throughout the contest today. No, nah, it's, it's nationals. It's been crazy. I mean, it's just been like three three days, like top to bottom with just yo-yoing and like hanging out and, um, you know, yelling and everything. Yeah, that's why I miss. Like I've been to a few like state, like smaller contests this year, but it's just really fun to like get back to just being in a room with a ton of yo-yoers and you know, it's just a fun weekend. So for anybody who maybe has never been to a yo-yo contest before, what would you tell them? Uh, Lots of yo-yoing and <laughs> lots of stoners and nerds and just people of all kinds. It's a very eclectic group. Uh, just you'll meet a variety of people and it's kind of fun. Just nice. how many interesting characters are in the yo-yo community. So what's something, if you had to go all the way back in time um, and talk to yourself, you know, a month after you started yo-yoing, what's something that you wish you knew earlier that you know now? Just have fun, you know, don't, you know, like a lot of yo-yoers get super emotional, especially when you're younger. It's always like this huge intimidating thing, but you know, just be open and talk to everyone and have fun and yeah, just enjoy it. That's like the number one. All right, so um, I'm assuming, you know, right from the shirt, you're associated with Good Life Yo-Yos, right? Yeah, yep. So uh, what's something that um, you really enjoy about Good Life Yo-Yos as a brand? Oh, just the, the designs of the yo-yos are very fun, but also very like playable and like give me like what I need as a competitive yo-yoer. And just the colors and most of all the team. Like, I, you know, they're all my friends and it's just an enjoyable experience being able to, you know, support the homies and, you know, hang out and have fun. Yeah, I mean, that's definitely what it's all about. Um, anything else you want to say before we break? Uh, no. All right, well, th <laughs> thanks for taking the time out today to, uh, you know, talk to us here. Oh, thank you for pulling me out there. All right, <laughs> thanks so much.